Hey everybody, back to show a few things here. Been picking up a variety of stuff lately. And you can kind of disregard the mess of cards back there. But that's mostly a bunch of lots I've been picking up. Stuff from the 90s. Cards from sets that I liked back then. Not even sure if I'm going to end up making a video for all of that stuff. It's a lot of base. But I don't know, some of it's pretty cool. Stuff from like Finest and SPX, EX, stuff like that. So... I'll have to think about it. Maybe I will show some of it before I put it away. But let's not worry about that stuff right now. Let's get to some of these other pickups I have here. I have stuff from eBay and COMC and I think one from Listia. And I'm going to be doing my pickup videos a bit differently. Rather than showing a mix of sports, I'm going to try to keep it specific to one sport per video. I know some people just like seeing certain sports. And this will also help me keep some of these videos a bit shorter. So just something I want to try out. So this video will just be baseball. Let's start with one from eBay. Picked up this Daryl Strawberry Triple Relic from 05 Absolute. Really cool. I don't have a lot of nice Daryl Strawberry stuff in a Yankee uniform. Mostly base. And I wasn't even looking for this. I was looking for some Bernie Williams stuff. But as some of you know, on eBay, on the bottom of the page, they usually suggest some other auctions. And they always get me with that. So I saw they were advertising this auction, and I clicked on it and ended up winning it a few days later. But glad that I did. Really like the look of that card. And it's numbered to 25. And it does say the materials come from game-worn items. So you got a piece of his glove, jersey, and pants right there. So really nice looking card. Absolute always did some really cool stuff back then. And got a few more from eBay here. Got a couple of these Bernie Williams bat relics from O2 Stadium Club. And the cool thing about this set was they used different pieces of the bat. So there's a piece of the handle. And then this one's a piece of the trademark. And there's also a, a piece of the barrel and not sure if there are any other ones other than that. I know Nate tops 8541. He has all the ones from the, the Bonds cards from this set. That's kind of what made me check this set out. And once I saw Bernie had some cards in there, I knew I had to get these. So that's yet another reason why it's great to watch each other's videos. You can get some ideas on stuff to pick up for your own collection. And you see they're numbered differently. This one's numbered to 110. This one's at a 210. So again, I gotta check out which ones I'm missing to complete that. Here's some stuff from COMC. It was a mixed sports order from COMC, but again, I'm just gonna show the baseball stuff here. And as usual, some of these I bought a long time ago. Like this one I got way back when this set first came out, the Topps Heritage, the Deckle Edge, Stanton. But as usual, I like to build up an order of at least 50 cards or so before I tell them to ship my order so I don't mind waiting a bit and this one I picked up a bit more recently Gary Sanchez a lot of his stuff is much cheaper now felt like the past few years some of his low-end inserts and base were kind of overpriced but he's having a bit of a down year so stuff is a bit easier to pick up now also got this Chapman purple that's at a 250. Got this Andrew Jones. He's another guy. I don't have a lot of nice cards of him as a Yankee, so wanted to get at least one nice one for the binder. And as you all know, a lot of this COMC stuff is really cheap. Got some Yvonne Rodriguez inserts. These I had picked up a while ago. Nice one there from Metal Platinum Portraits. And this Donruss Dominators with Rodriguez and Piazza and Darren Dalton. See, it still has that protective film. I'll keep that on there unless I pick up another one. And here's one from Listia, which is a kind of lesser known site. Haven't been going there much lately, but got this Jeter in there. Just been looking to pick up some more Jeter binder material. Here's another Bernie Williams pickup. I've been kind of on a Bernie Williams kick lately since I've been kind of reorganizing the binder to make a video for those. 
been wanting to pick up some more of his cards. So that's just a nice one there from MLB Showdown, which is some kind of card game. But this is one of the parallels, which was a bit tougher to get. So I got that for like a dollar on eBay. And here are some hits I got from COMC. Really sweet one here from Immaculate. Kenny Vargas, number to 25. That's for the Puerto Rican collection. Really hope he ends up getting a shot somewhere. I think he could get he could be a decent DH for somebody. Maybe a small market team like Tampa or somewhere like that. And these last two are from National Treasures. This one I definitely bought a few months ago back when this guy was still pitching. Jordan Montgomery of the Yankees. I remember I picked this up and about two or three days later it was found out that he needed Tommy John surgery so he's missing the rest of this year and maybe part of next year but he isn't like a hard thrower or anything so I think he'll be able to bounce back and pitch pretty much the same way he was before the injury but still that kind of sucked because I probably could have saved a few bucks on it if I had waited a bit longer and this one also from National Treasures from the Mets, Brandon Nimmo, number to 25. The patch is kind of poorly placed in there, but still a sweet looking card. And he's become one of my favorite Mets this year, even though he's been kind of cold lately, but very energetic player and always seems to have a smile on his face. You could tell he just loves playing the game. So like I said, been becoming a big fan of him. So wanted to get a nice card of him. Got to get some magnetic holders for those, and as well as a bunch of other cards. But that's going to be it for now. Again, I got to figure out how to make a video for all of that stuff and some other stuff as well. So I will be talking to you all again soon.